10,000 galaxies. How do you take a picture of the beginning of time? In 2004, astronomers led by Stephen Beckwith gambled on a wild idea. They pointed the Hubble Space Telescope at a patch of sky in the constellation Fornax so dark and empty it seemed pointless. For 11 straight days, Hubble stared into that void, gathering photons that had traveled for over 13 billion years. When the images were stitched together, the result was legendary. The Hubble Ultra Deep Field, in an area less than one-tenth the size of the full moon, nearly 10,000 galaxies appeared. Each smudge of light was an entire system of stars, gas, and dust. Here were cosmic pinwheels, ancient glowing ellipticals, and messy distant blue clumps, hinting at the universe's chaotic adolescence. This image gave astronomers their first real census of the early cosmos, allowing them to count and categorize galaxies from different epochs. It confirmed that galaxies evolve growing from smaller, more irregular shapes into the grand spirals we see today. This wasn't just a picture, it was a core sample of cosmic history, showing us what the universe looked like when it was just 800 million years old. For a generation this single breathtaking image defined the boundary of our observable universe. 